During episode 2 of Married at First Sight, Katina Good showed her cards regarding Elijahwan Dickerson's big personality and seemed overwhelmed. Elijahwan and Katina had loads of chemistry at the altar. Katina was all in on his aesthetics, including his face, build, and tattoos. At the same time, when it came to his rambling enthusiasm, she seemed a little more hesitant. Some MAFS fans weren't looking forward to season 14 because disaster seemed to be imminent in every corner. Katina and Elijahwan shared a passion for the party scene in their 20s, but both grew tired of dating casually and clubbing. They joined MAFS with a desire to skip nights out in favor of cozy dinners at home on the couch. However, Katina's family members seemed more convinced that she was ready for the next step in life than Elijah ones. Head previously used an alias for his player antics and had never voiced his desire to find a serious relationship with his family and friends. Meanwhile, Katina had been planning to get married for years without success. Katina told Mavs after party host Keshia Knight Pulliam that she felt uncomfortable locking eyes with a stranger. At the altar, she said that she felt overwhelmed. For better or worse, Olajuwon's big personality didn't exactly help that feeling fade. Keshia noted that Olajuwon seemed entirely smitten with her. On the other hand, Katina's eyes showed a lot of concern. She was glad she found an attractive person who could hold a conversation, but she didn't fully match Olajuwon's own excitement level. He asked, do you like a man? that shows his expressions, like his emotions? Katina answered, yeah, I don't have a problem with that. She then added, yeah or like cause I do. She validated his need to share, but seemed to grow slightly concerned over time. Mark Mar confirmed at the Married at First Sight after party that Elijah's party-loving antics and energy stole the show at the bachelor party. However, after marrying the controversial Lindsay, Hess developed a high tolerance for bouncing balls of endless commentary. Unlike Mark, Lindsay hadn't worn down Katina before meeting Elijah One. Things were nerve-wracking, but steamy at the altar. However, once Elijah One and Katina got a chance to talk, he got started and never stopped. Katina told the experts she was looking for a man who could hold a conversation. At the same time, the cuts of her nodding along to his thoughts indicated that he might be giving more than she had prepared for. When he went in for a second kiss, it was a little awkward, to say the least. If Katina's eyes said anything during the MAFs after party, it's that she will have more reactions to Elijah One's larger than life persona. Elijah One may seem too demanding to Katina. She may be far from shy herself, but time will tell whether the couple will clash when they have something to say. It's possible they will find common ground when it comes to expressing themselves. If one thing is for sure, it's that their married at first sight story is bound to be interesting.